So in this case, I'm trying to show you how to convert a data frame into data set. So one of the problem which you might run into while creating a data frame to a data set is nothing but the data types mapping between your uh, case class. So what is our case class here? It is nothing but order. You can actually get the details about data type and all with respect to your case class by saying Java P hyphen P order. In some cases it might not work, but in many cases it will work. So they are nothing but uh, uh, of type integer for order ID, string for order date, int for customer ID, and then string for order status. Now, when I create data frame out of our JSON data, so I'm actually saying spark.read.json mnt c data retail underscore db underscore JSON orders. Now the data frame is created. However, if you actually look at the schema, the schema is of type uh, uh, order customer ID with long, order date with string, order ID with long, order status with string. So there is a data type mismatch between what you have uh, specified as part of the case class using which you are trying to create a data set and the data frame that is created uh, using the JSON data. So because it actually go through the JSON data, it understand uh, the data a bit better. It, it determines what should be used for data type of the fields. Uh, and it, it assumed that it should be begin for order customer ID and order ID. That's what is happening here and then when we say orders df dot as and when we try to specify the case class as there is a mismatch within the data types it is complaining you can see here okay so what it is saying is you need to add an explicit cast to the input data to the higher position type of the field in the target object which means either you have to cast your data which is part of data frame while converting to the data set or you have to modify the definition of your order where it can fit whatever data types we are using here so we'll take the other route where will be creating the case class with order ID and order customer ID as begin. So the case class is created now. Now the order ID and order customer ID are of type begin. Even now when we actually try to create a data set out of the data frame, it will still throw an exception. Oh, it worked. Let us read the data. Yeah, it worked. So there is no exception. It worked, but there will be exception when we try to use standard map function, which I will be showing later. So now you can see that the JSON um, uh, means the fields from the uh, the fields of the data frame which is created out of JSON are of type begin string, begin and uh, string. And as we have specified, even our case class as begin string, begin string, it worked fine. However, if I try to use the map function after this and try to read a particular field such as o dot order ID as part of standard map function, here it will fail. You can see here, unable to find encoder for type stored in a data set. In this case, order ID is of type begin. And for begin, there is no uh, serialized alternative for Spark. And uh, as there is no serialized encoder for begin, it started failing. But if you actually say dot too long or too int, if it can be accommodated as, as int, it will work fine. Okay, so these are the things which you need to keep in mind. You need to understand the dependencies between the data types of the data frame and the uh, case class which you are trying to use to uh, create the data set. Once you create the data set, you also need, need to understand the repercussions when you try to use standard MapReduce APS on the data set. And it is highly unlikely that we use standard uh, MapReduce operations on top of dataset. But if it is inevitable and if you have to use, then you have to spend some time uh, with respect to core APIs and you have to uh, leverage those things as part of your data processing.